I'm Shirley. Today we will be baking matcha switch roll. For the full recipe, please refer to the description box below. So now let's get started. Alright. In a small plate, put in all purpose flour with 1 tablespoon of green tea powder. Sift it for a few times to make sure the flour is well combined. Let's separate the egg yolk and the egg white in different bowl. Bake the egg whites until for me. Gradually add in half of the sugar. Continue beating until it turns stiff pig form. Put in all the sugar into the egg yolks. Beat it until it turns pale yellow and thick. After that, put in the green tea flour and 2 tablespoons of vegetable oil. Use a spatula to mix everything in. Fold in the meringue. Get ready your baking pans with baking paper in it. I'm using a 9 inch square shapes baking pans spread the batter evenly to the side give it a few table table to get rid of the air bubbles Bit at 340 degrees Fahrenheit, which is 107 degrees Celsius, for about 25 minutes or until the top is lightly browned and fragrant. My cake is ready. Remove it from the oven and give it a few table table on the table to prevent it from shrinking. Remove it out from the baking pans get ready a new sheet of baking paper cover it and flick it to the other side peel off the paper and cover it and let it cool now we can make our fillings. Put in 1 tablespoon of unsalted softened butter 
and two tablespoon of softened cream cheese, half teaspoon of vanilla extract. Half cups of confectioner sugar. If you find it is too thick, you may add in some milk. If it is too runny, you can add in more confectioner sugar. Be until you get the consist consistencies that you want. If you are not using it now, you can put it in the fridge first. Okay, it's cool. Flip it back to the other side, which is the brown side on top, facing up. Spread the filling evenly on the surface of the cake. I'm putting in blueberries. You can put in any fruits that you like. Make sure you roll it tightly. You can use a rolling pin to help you. Chill the roll in the fridge for an hour. My roll is ready. Remove the paper. Trim the side to make it nicer. Cutting time. Okay, one piece for myself again. Before serving, sprinkle some cocoa powder on top to make it look prettier. Alright, one bite for myself. Yum. next bite for you thank you for watching see you next time bye bye